He was um, someone that uh, spent his entire life understanding policy, but also um, really engaged in the practice of, of shaping it, implementing it. Grandland Johnson certainly had a, a great effect on me uh, in terms of, um, certainly in terms of understanding uh, some of the most important aspects of county governance, which uh, I completely appreciate now and I try to put in practice myself, and that is to really look out for the most vulnerable uh, among us, meaning the children, uh, the elderly, uh, the sick, and the poor. I've never seen anybody that represented his constituents as well as Grantland did. Represented his district, uh, worked hard for the economically disadvantaged people throughout the county. Uh, certainly his passion to uh, bring about positive change in the community and to, uh, you know, one, once you get behind something to really, uh, you know, put your uh, mind and your efforts and your, and your uh, you know, whole person to try to achieve that and, and recognize that sometimes though that you had to push, you know, the establishment uh, very hard to accomplish that and I think again it goes, you know, some of his work in his uh, younger years both in high school but in college and then this is his experience I think, his life experience and what he brought uh, uh, to, uh, to any board or any body that he served on. One of my first encounters with Grantland I said, can you imagine that we have the opportunity? There's three Johnsons. This is our chance. What do you say we just change it to Johnson County if we can get three votes? And uh, he laughed. He had a cute laugh. He had a good laugh. Grantland and I often differed on issues, and we would fight like cats and dogs during the board meeting. But at the end of the day, we were always friends, and we had a mutual respect for each other. And I really enjoyed uh, working with Grantland. One time, uh... Grantland and I were asked by a local radio station to debate the Auburn Dam. I was a proponent in favor of it. He was opposed. And, uh, I learned after that never to go into a debate with Grantland. He, he was just very sharp. We didn't always vote together. That's not possible. But we certainly voted together more than we voted apart, I'm sure. I thought, my gosh, this guy is incredible. And I watched him on the city council because I'm a city resident. I thought, and you know, all the issues he is involved in and what he talks about, the County Board of Supervisors have to, has to deal with. His voice is needed on this board. That is what this board needs.